what is good youtube it is your girl brinks i'm coming to you guys on a sunday this cooking sunday another youtube video i hope you guys have been enjoying these quick cooking videos Bruh. what in the world it's gonna be another quick cooking youtube video you guys so um it's gonna be like a vegetarian meal today because your girl forgot to get some some meat to go with this. Like, I didn't even think about this meal until, like, really last minute. So, it just occurred to me that I didn't have anything else to kind of add to meat-wise. But, recipe kind of just popped up on Pinterest. And I was like, that is a really good idea. I'm in a pasta-type mood. It seems like it'll be delicious. So, I'm going to do it. Only thing is, I'm going to put my spin on it, so it's not really a traditional lo mein dish. It's like a Brinks lo mein dish. Um, Seriously, mommy. I didn't have a lot of ingredients to make like a stir fry sauce, so my sauce is going to be a little bit different. Um, I am going to use some ginger, some garlic, some um, teriyaki, some hot sauce for some spice. I wish I had some sriracha, but I don't. Um, and then also some chicken broth to mix in there. And that is going to add kind of the flavor for the sauciness. And then um, I brought the frozen veggies for the stove stir fried veggies. Um, I thought about last minute, I could have added like some flank steak to it. I could have added some shrimp to it. I could have added some chicken strips to it, like some grilled chicken strips. But, yeah, I don't have any. And then to make it keto, we have, of course, our palm mini noodles. Um, and I have three packs of the linguine that we're going to add to it. Um, so, of course, your girl has already gotten started. Um, we have our veggies. This is the first bag of veggies anyway, y'all. I have two bags. I am going to season them. Um... But this is just what the first bag is looking like. Um, this is the ingredients for the sauce. What you guys are seeing right now is the chicken broth and some of the teriyaki um, in there. I am going to be adding the second bag of stir fry to the mix. And I will be back. I'm going to go check on TK, y'all. He's been a little, because he was breathing. Uh, and some of the words were frustrating them. So I'm going to go check on him real quick and I will be right back, y'all. Be right back. All right, y'all. I am using garlic salt to season the veggies. Some roasted garlic and herb to season the veggies. Some black pepper. And if my smoke detector go off, y'all, it is really sensitive. I just put these vegetables on. So it should have no reason for going off, but just to make y'all aware, because I was just warming up the oil and it just went off. And nothing was even in there yet. Very sensitive. <laughs> Onion powder. But it's like literally right here by the stove. Which sucks. And then slap your mama. These are the only seasonings that I'm using to season these vegetables with. And stir fry. Let these bad boys do their thing. Oh, y'all. And by the way, we went to go see... Um, Transformers one yesterday. Absolutely loved it. If you guys do not know the backstory, I don't want to do any spoilers to this video. But if you guys do not know the backstory between um Optimus and um Megatron, I highly advise you guys to go see it because and I love Transformers. I watched the actual cartoon as a kid, but 
I had no idea some of the things I found out of this movie. It was really good. Um, there are some complaints about, about, <laughs> of course, you have um, Mr. Thor himself playing as Optimus's voice. So you can kind of hear like a little bit of a Thor coming out, but I feel like he did Optimus some justice. Um, I think he definitely did do Optimus some justice. Um, but I did get where they was coming from because I did get some hints of Thor coming out when he was talking, Mr. Chris. Um, but yeah, y'all, it was a good movie. It was definitely a good movie. Uh, but then again, I am a Transformer fan. Um, I'm just waiting for them to release like all of the Transformers movies so I can watch them in order. Because like, I want to watch that movie in that movie first and then i don't know if they did if rise of the beast is like the actual going to be the second movie that needs to be watched after that i don't think it is though because i feel like there's a movie or two that should be like right in between that one and rise of the beast because there's more to um to their story as well so um, I feel like there's more to that story. So we're going to be waiting on that and then go from there. But I'm just waiting for them to release all of these Transformer movies, y'all, so I can watch them in order. But the ending of the movie did lead to another movie. So just waiting on that, y'all. But I'm going to let this cook, y'all, and I will be back. Alright guys, we are making the sauce now, so I have my, um, I actually put a little bit of balsamic in here too, so I'm going to grate some ginger, but enough to give it some flavor a little bit more let me try I don't need much to try I'm gonna try here I only need a little bit more Good job, kitty kitty. Mm -hmm. All right, kitty kitty, that's good. Thank you, baby. All right. Perfect. Going in or not, Goofy? Just put it in there. Thank you. <laughs> right. Teriyaki sauce. What? What should? Put we... it on paper towel. Right here. Mm -hmm. And what should we put it? Put that on paper towel too. Let me do it. Oh my God. <laughs> chunk don't shake it just push pull like squirt there you go that's that good kitty kitty that all? yes might need a little bit more and some hot sauce a squirt a couple you know mommy likes the hot that all? No, it's not all. What the heck? <laughs> all right. Do you like hot sauce? I guess I like hot sauce. And mix it all together. I don't like hot sauce. I'm aware, kitty kitty. 
Let me smell it. <laughs> smell it, Goofy. What in the world? <laughs> Bruh. <gasps> you so extra. That's, that's, why you, disgusting. that's why you about to do after school drama class. That's disgusting. It is not. That smells amazing. You are tripping, sexy. You don't know what good smells are. You don't know what good smells are, y'all. All right. So, so that's mixed together. Next thing we're going to do, y'all, is we're going back to the stove. Back to our skillet. Going to ignite that back up. We're going to add some olive oil. Are going to be combining everything back together, y'all. So after this heats up, I'll be right back, y'all. Ah, what's wrong with you? <laughs> now, the palm noodles, which has been nice and rinsed off, you guys. Always remember, like if you use these noodles, they do have to be thoroughly rinsed off before you cook them. Um. And then you literally, you're literally just you just warming them up pretty much and going from there because they are kind of like a vegetable. They, I think they are actually a vegetable, to be honest. Some of our sauce. Yeah. Gonna add the first plate of veggies. Back in. Yeah, as you guys can see, the heart of palm like noodles is already starting to absorb. The juices from our homemade sauce. I really wish I had some meat to add to this though, y'all. So it smells amazing though. It smells really, really good. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna finish cooking this off camera, and I will be back to show you guys the final product. All right, y'all. This is the final product. All completed. All done. This is my plate without its fork. Per usual. About to grub, you guys. Like I said, if you have not seen the new Transformers movie, definitely go see it if you are a Transformers fan. Um, it's not as bad as everybody is saying it. I actually liked it. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot um, so definitely go check it out it is worth seeing um, you guys will not regret it if you go see it unless you just do not like what is happening in the movie what is happening in here don't move around too too much I can't put your little legs in here you ain't got no pants on but anyways Say bye to YouTube, Goofy. Hey, you moving around too much. <laughs> I will be seeing you guys. I got laundry to do. Get him cleaned up and ready for bed. Um, until next week, you guys. 
See ya.